Well, Rowlett High School now has a reset room on campus. The room will serve as a place for students to take a break, work through their anger, and recenter outside of the normal school environment. Fox Wars Rebecca Butcher spoke with the school about how this room will help them work with students going through hard times. Rebecca? Yeah, Blake. Well, Rowlett High School's reach, reset room is a place for at-risk students to recharge. The woman behind the project says that she's blown away a, a church in Dallas actually reached out financially in a major way. We wanted to create a space here at a high school level where we can invite students, some of our most at-risk students, and just kind of give them a different type of space to come work, do some work in. Carmen Chadwick with Rowlett High School helps focus on students as a whole and supports them not just academically, but emotionally and socially. We needed a space that um, would invite them to come into and kind of let their guard down, and we just didn't really have that. Chadwick reached out on Facebook for funding help for the reset room and got a large response back from the community. A friend put her in touch with her church, Preston Hollow, which helped financially with the project. We can all recognize that we need a place a safe place to disconnect from our daily challenges and really de-escalate or take the emotions out of things or know how to deal with emotions. Volunteers who put the room together Saturday are from Preston Hollow UMC and Rowlett High School. When it was really that we're doing this for the kids and it's to give them a place that they can go, everyone was like, I'm in. The room is the first of its kind at a secondary school for Garland ISD. In putting that design together, thought, how does all of this culminate? Well, it's a home. That's what we're all looking for. The space has a living room, a desk area, and a dining room with a kitchenette as well as a patio. We will start with 14 children that we have vetted and hand-selected that we see great potential in. They're some of our most at-risk kids, and we're going to start investing them in them on a daily basis. Chadwick says she and the district will be getting training on restorative circles, groups that offer support and discuss accountability. When our students leave our campus and go to uh, an alternative uh, school for like 30 days for different offenses and then come back to us doing some restorative circles called re-entry circles where they come back into our school. Preston Hollow purchased everything going into the room with its funds. They're planting seeds into these children's lives. When these children leave this high school, they've invested in their legacy. And the reset room isn't just for students, it's also for teachers to voice their concerns.